Hello Taurus, this is Debs and this is your TGIF weekly reading for Friday the 4th of August 2023. Taurus, how are you guys? It's great to be with you. Let's just jump in and find out what's going on. Thank goodness it's Friday, people. I hope you guys have got a great weekend planned ahead. Now the deck that I'm using is a Tarot Royale. All the decks I use are in the description box below. You know the whole spiel, right? As well as my website. If you feel that this reading resonates with you and you'd like a private reading, okay? Archangel Michael, thank you for joining us. This is the TGIF weekly reading for my Taurians. Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. Friday the 4th of August 2023. Taurus, 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 Taurus. Yes, yes. Yes, that's it. All right, Michael's saying that's it. Let's have a look, guys. Wow, Taurus, these readings are really dramatic for this week. I don't know why. Um, Taurus, you could have been living at a distance from someone, okay? Waiting for your ships to come in with this person. Unbeknown to you, with the Eight of Coins... I'm sorry, guys, I'm hearing tax evasion. I'm hearing cooking the books. And that's weird because I don't say things like that. Cooking the books. Unbeknown to you, this person may have been doing something underhand to make money. They could also have been involved in something that was illegal. Okay, they could have been in a situation where, where they were involved in, say, money laundering, something like that. Something was given to them and they gave someone in return and it was about them making money, okay? Taurus, I think with the Nine of Wands, this person realised that they got themselves in too deep in a situation, maybe with a person or government body or group of people that they couldn't handle, okay? They received a very difficult message of truth from someone. Again, it could be the law, could be police found out. It could be that someone called them out. And with the energy of the Ten of Swords, they could have ended up facing jail time or they could simply feel deceived by the people or the person that they were interacting with. So, Taurus, five of wands, lots of arguments and disagreements, lots of angry words spoken. I can't believe you did that. I can't believe you got involved with that, that sort of energy. And I think, Taurus, if this has already happened, you are healing and sort of getting yourself back together again emotionally. You are turning your back on this person. You're working on your own foundation and you're going to be moving into a beautiful, temperate place. You're going to be healing, Taurus, okay? Little do you know that what you've got coming is a beautiful connection with the Ten of Cups. You're going to meet someone new. And with the energy of the Hierophant, you may shockingly find yourself in a very serious commitment. I'm hearing by the end of this year, okay? Now, you could be moving into a commitment with a Sag or a fellow Taurus or Taurus, this is you, okay? You're going to cut your losses. You're going to move on. Oh my goodness. Okay, guys, let's get into the second deck. Here we go. This is the Tarot du Soleil. So what have we got from this deck, please, for my lovely Taurians? Yeah, this person either had money issues, Taurus, and they were doing something they shouldn't do and they got found out, or they got involved with a really dodgy group of people. It might even have been innocently, but found themselves wrapped up in a situation they couldn't get out of, right? You know? Yeah. This was very difficult, Taurus, for you. Okay. Let's have a look, guys. So Taurus, um, we start with a six of pentacles, six of coins, six of coins twice. This person was paying for something 
which in turn they were hoping was going to provide them with a lot of money. Now, this could have been a scam investment or it could have been something simply illegal. But this is what this person was hoping for, to get to the 10 of coins. It could be a get rich quick scheme, something like that. But with the tower, everything fell apart and I think they lost quite a lot of money. They were only left with the ace of coins, which is one coin out of 10. Basically, they lost everything in the situation. And with the nine of swords, they may also have been worried about being hauled up by the authorities, you know, facing jail time, realising that they got themselves all sort of entangled in a situation or a group of people that they shouldn't have done. They're facing Judgment Day, okay? And with the energy of the Five of Wands, arguments, disagreements, Seven of Coins, you are going to look back at the past, Taurus, okay? With the energy of the Death card, it's over. You're washing yourself clean from this person's energy. There is heartbreak with the Three of Swords, but when you walk away with the Eight of Cups, you're going to rebuild your strength. And with the Ace of Cups, Taurus, you've got new love coming in, okay? So there's a lot of cards there, guys. But um, yeah. So Taurus, you're going to sort yourself out. I think you're going to completely detach from the situation. This person's learnt their lesson. And I feel you're deciding to move on. I don't think you want to be associated with this person anymore. You're going to heal from this. You may look back at the past and think to yourself, that was such a shame. It could have been a beautiful relationship or it was a beautiful relationship. But Taurus, I think you've got new love coming in. OK, I think the divine is saying step away, step back. This person has to face their karma. And I feel as if you're going to meet someone new. All right. You're going to have the strength to not lose faith in love. OK. All right, guys. So whew, let's get into tarot. So here we go, Taurus. Where does this start? Please, Michael, thank you. Where does this start? Oh, unbelievable. Six of coins for the third time. This is someone who was giving something to someone else in order to make money. Yeah. But this was shady. What they got themselves involved with was shady. Or the people they were dealing with were not to be trusted. Yeah, three of coins. Now, I'm hearing money laundering, making money, right? Or laundering it. Um, washing money clean, okay? They got themselves involved in something that they shouldn't have done because maybe they were strapped for cash. Maybe they were trying to, you know, make a quick buck. Yeah, they did it because they were sat in the five of coins. This is all financial, people. They did it because they, they didn't have any money. They may have felt they didn't have a choice. Again, they were somehow making money. Somehow making money. On the quiet, doing this in an underhand way. Wow, Taurus. Yeah, until they got hauled up by the divine and they had to face Judgment Day. Okay, so someone could have been watching them or a group of people they were involved with for a long time. And I think this person got themselves into trouble. Yeah, they got themselves into trouble legally. That can be a legal court case. This is someone who had to face the truth that they lost their money that they might have invested in, in the situation. They could have had to give the courts or someone else or a legal body nine of their ten pentacles that they'd managed to accumulate and they were simply left with one. Yeah, chariot. Chariot. So this person may have simply just left the area, got out of dodge because... They were involved with the law, I feel. Yes, King of Swords, they might have got involved with the law. Or they were hauled up by 
someone who called them out. Yeah. Queen of Swords. Wow. Could have been two police officers. Yeah. They somehow realised that this person was playing a really risky game. And with the Nine of Cups, they were being overindulgent. Right? They were doing things they shouldn't do. This is really tricky. Yeah. They got themselves caught up in a complete mess. Very complicated. There could have been a group of people doing things in a sequence. You know, someone doing one thing and then passing it to another person. They then took it forward and passed it to another person. There could have been a ring of people that were involved here in this scheme. Yeah, ten of coins. There was a group of people that were all involved in an underhand scheme making money. All right. Yeah. Eight of Swords. I think this person did this initially to get themselves out of a tricky situation financially. I then feel they felt they couldn't get out of it because they were in too deep. Okay, there could have been threats made, that sort of thing. But I think this person became really scared that first of all, they may lose their money. Second of all, that they were dealing with people that they realised were quite cutthroat, you know? Two of Pentacles, sort of what have I got myself into? This person suddenly felt very vulnerable. What have I done, right? I shouldn't have done this. I shouldn't have done this. Yeah, this person was sat in the energy of the devil, Capricorn energy. I shouldn't have done this. Whatever this was, they were sat firmly in a very toxic situation. Three of Swords. Taurus, if you haven't already found out about this, you will find out. Okay. Page of Swords, there's going to be a very straight conversation. And I think what you're going to say is you're detaching, Taurus. Yeah, Hermit, you could have dealt with a Virgo, but you're detaching. You're completely cutting off from this person because you don't want to be associated with them. Yeah, Seven of Wands, you're afraid that if you stay connected to this person, you may get pulled into this sticky underhand situation yourself. I don't know whether or not you guys were living together. I think you were living separately. What is Taurus thinking about? Protecting your own money. Yeah, Taurus, you could have thought, wow, I didn't know that they were involved in that. I need to pull back and keep my own finances safe. So you went into protection mode and I think you just cut off from this person. <sighs> yeah, because there was a lot of drama based around whatever this was. I think you were also looking back at the past in inner conflict, wondering how long this person had been doing this for. But Taurus, Queen of Pentacles, this could be you. I think you pulled away from this person in shock, thinking, all right, well, I'm not going to get involved with this person. I, I'm not wanting to be associated with this person. It is done. Yeah. You turned away from this person, leaving them to face karma. <sighs> Taurus, this may have been difficult. You may feel as if this person got themselves wrapped up with the wrong group of people. You might have thought that initially they just wanted to make a bit of easy cash on the side. But it became heavy. It became much more intense. They got further drawn into whatever this was. And I think that this person had to face the consequences. Yeah, they had to face the consequences of sitting in the devil and the seven of swords.
Yeah. Okay. So Taurus, I feel as if this person is going to sort themselves out. If they were sat in shadow, they're going to ascend into the light. They're going to walk away from overindulgence. They're going to walk away from the group of people they were embroiled with. They're going to clean up their act. But I think, Taurus, for you, this is done. Yeah. Even though they are going to get out of this, I think you're going to be so shocked if you find out what this is, when you find out what this is, that you're simply just going to detach. It's just going to be no, 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 no. I'm off, right? Yeah. Eight of Wands, I'm off. Angry words between the two of you, Taurus. Okay. Four of coins. Taurus, you're hanging on to your own money. Okay. You're keeping what you've got safe. And I think you're simply going to look to the future. Okay. You could have worried that being in association with this person, your property would be at risk. I mean, I don't know whether or not... You guys were even living together and they were doing whatever this is under your roof and you were questioned. Um, but you're off. You're off. You're sort of deciding, oh, no, no, no. I'm heading off. Okay, yeah, because something came to light, Taurus. You could have connected with a Leo. But with the energy of the sun, it may also be that you decided to leave or they had to leave the country. Yeah, something came to light and I was going to say, and it was a shock, the tower. And the tower fell. And the tower fell. But Taurus, you are nothing to do with this, okay? You're going to be moving forward. You're going to be letting the whole situation go. You may not want to even communicate with this person anymore. Um and get out and just get out six of swords moving to karma waters leaving the situation behind empress hanging on to your abundance taurus okay hanging on to your abundance getting away from this person protecting yourself and moving on and moving on Page of Wands, they may try to reach out to you in the future, but I think as far as you're concerned, it's done. Yeah, Page of Cups. So they may reach out to you to simply say, I'm so sorry. What are they going to say to Taurus? Wow, guys, the death card, Scorpio. What they're going to say is, is that they've shed their skin, they face karma, and they have changed. What are they going to say to Taurus? Wow. Taurus, they may want to come back to you, but I think you are cutting this person out of your life. I think whatever this was was so shocking, or you're going to find out what it is, and you're going to be so shocked that you just don't ever want to speak to this person again. Yeah. Yeah. Three of Cups. I think they were wearing, I think, Taurus, they were wearing a false mask and collaborating with at least two or three other people. But I think you're done. Taurus, you're done. Yeah. Nine of Pentacles. Now, Taurus, you could actually be reuniting with somebody from your past that you may be interested in. Hmm. Okay, the world. You're closing out a cycle, Taurus. And you're moving forward onto a brand new path. What is happening in Taurus's future? What is happening in Taurus's future? Cards are feeling sticky. What is happening in Taurus's future? Okay. The hangman. So you either want to take some time to yourself 
Or you could be moving into a situation, a relationship with a Pisces. Anything else? Or a Leo. Okay, strength card. You're going to have the strength to gather yourself together, to think about what you want for the future. Underneath the deck, the faith card. Okay, this is you, Taurus. This is you. Keeping the faith and moving forward onto a new cycle. Okay, Knight of Cups, you could be meeting someone extremely romantic, somebody who wants to build with you. But I think, Taurus, this other situation is going to end very quickly. It may be a bit painful, but you are going to be absolutely fine. Okay. Wow, Taurus, let's move into messages. Here we go, Taurus, Hidden Truth Oracle. What would this person want to say to my lovely Taurians? I regret lying to you. So you may have, you know, asked them about their job. They may have been a bit elusive. They can't stop thinking about you. I think they feel really guilty because they knew that there was danger of pulling you into what they had created. I wonder if you're happy without me. They miss you. I will wait for a sign from you. Taurus, I don't think you're going to be messaging this person again. I think you're out of there. My life is not as together as it seems. Yet yeah, they hid a lot from you, Taurus. They hid a lot from you. I remember every detail of that day. Taurus, that could be the day that this person was found out and you realised what was going on. Final message from this person to Taurus. I feel you leaving me behind. Yep, yeah, Taurus, I'm afraid I think you are. I don't think you could leave fast enough. So you're going to get yourself together. I think you are going to be learning from this it could be to get to know someone before you move into a relationship that type of thing but you're out of it you're innocent in this Taurus and I think Taurus you're going to heal and find new love okay so my beautiful Taurians wow I am leaving it there have a great weekend take care of you and I'll be back before you know it with your next set of readings bye Taurus